today my topic uh, on cl class 9th because before of uh, this video uh, I explained about the number system in which types of number and some operations already we discussed in the previous video but in this video we discuss about the operation on real numbers because I also explain about the real numbers all numbers including in uh, real numbers like natural number, whole number, integers, rational number and irrational numbers. So before of this we explain about the rational number operations like sum of rational number between uh, rational numbers you find out represent rational number on number line also uh, represent uh, irrational numbers on number line but uh, now especially on operation on real number here we have a topic of irrational numbers because irrational number we know that like all square root terms all cube root terms they are including in the uh, irrational numbers so there are four operations we have in the irrational number first is like addition subtraction multiplication divide okay because these four operations they are the basic operation of mathematics and now here we introduce what you mean by the uh, irrational numbers like root terms you show out like root 2 and root 3 okay they, the, uh, this numbers you write down in the square root so what do you mean by the root if no numbers are down here that is a root it means suppose this uh, given form in the radical you represent in form of the exponential then to the power 1 by 2 Okay, every root sign shows their power is 1 by 2. Similarly, here root 3, it means 3 to the power 1 by 2. Similarly, but here 3 and then 2 is given, it means 2 to the power 1 by 3. So, this is the power of this radical sign. Like suppose n power is given and at the root of 2, it means 2 to the power 1 by n. So this is the root, shows the root. No number is given here, that is uh, you already consider that is a 1 by 2. And number is, is given that you take like 3 here, so you take 1 by 3. And is given that you have 1 by n and then so on, so many properties are here. So this is the concept of uh, rational numbers. And this is also called SERS. Especially here, this word uh, short by this, this type of terms, like SERS. So first, uh, here we introduce about the search. Search is means you represent the number in the radical forms like a symbol, uh, square root sign, cube root sign, fourth root, fifth root, nth root are given. And now some operations they are related with the search. Because some basic operation we start, then we uh, find out addition, subtraction, multiplication and then divide. So before this, first I understand the concept of the uh, rational numbers if they are given in form of the square root may be given in form of the cube roots so first you know the concept of in exponential form if numbers given in the root then how you represent in form of the exponential terms so that is very easy and I also here we uh, I explain about the their power how you represent so there are two basic terms here we discuss pure sorts and mixers so what do you mean by pure search and what do you mean by the mixers then we go on the operation after for first here we explain about the pure search and mixers then we go okay then here we add on 2 root 3 2 root 3 okay so 2 is a multiple of this root sign and now here this is the power power means inside a small number is given okay so here 2 root 3 it means this is a mix search is given and now you can convert into the pure form of this search so depend on here root if no root sign is given here then you consider as a 2 so this 2 you can, uh, convert into inside then here you multiply 2 times if you want convert into the pure search so this 2 inside taking then 2 times you multiply then 3 to the 6 6 to the 12 so 12 is a pure search Okay, then we have the example from 3 root 2. So now this 3 inside now how many times? 2 times, so 2 3 is a 6, 6 3 is a 18. So 18 is a pure search. And now again we have the another example. 
like 4 root 3. So how you convert 4 root 3? Means first you include this 4 inside 2 times multiply with the given number. So 3 into 4, 3 4 are 12, 12 4 are 48. So this number is 48, then this is converted to the pure, uh, pure cells. And now again we have the fourth example like 2, but here cube is given and inside number is 3. So what do you mean by this? 2 cube root of 3. 2 cube root of 3 is you want to convert into the pure cells, then this 2 inside multiply 3 times because its power is 3. So you write down as it is power 3, you put as it is here, 3 as it is and outside value you uh, put inside how many times depend on its power. Power is 3 then you multiply 2, 3 times inside. So your pure source is now here 3, then 3 to the 6, 6 to the 12, 12 to the 24. So your answer is 24. So that is very easy concept. You convert any square root term into form of the pure search. Always you put a outside value you put inside depend on their power. If power is 2 then you multiply inside 2 times. If power is 3 then you multiply 3 times. Okay we take another example like fourth here we have suppose 2 and here write down 4 and then 2. Now power is 4. And now again you can convert into the pure cells. Then you put power your 4 as it is, 2 as it is. And this 2 you put inside how many times? 4 times you multiply inside. Okay, this 4 times you multiply inside. Then 2 to the 4, 4 to the 8, 8 to the 16 and 16 to the 32. So 4th root of 32 is the answer. So any type of questions you can try. You convert into the pure cells. That is only one thing is important, outside value you multiply inside but depend on its power, if power is not given means you multiply two times, if power is given then depend on the power, if power is three you multiply inside three times, four times depend on the power. Okay then, now second phase is what you convert into the mixers. Okay so now uh, start from the second example like mixers. Okay, now start for mix, make sense. Okay, you have suppose 80, like a start here 80. Okay, and then you convert 18 into the mix search. So first you find out the prime factor of 18. 2 9s are, 3s are, and then 3 1s are. Okay, so write down all factors inside. Okay, depend here what is given. No term is given means 2 is already here. So if numbers are in pair, so 3 in pair, so 3 is outside and then 3 root 2 you have. So that is you convert into the mix uh, search. Every number if they are inside then you taking outside. Depend on power here you put outside. Similarly we have another example like root 27 okay then again you find the prime vector of 27 3 3 is up and 1 up. so you write down all factor inside 3 into 3 into 3 and now we have the pair of 3 so this is outside you have 3 root 3 but now same question we have but power is 3 and we have 54 inside. Now not square root is given there. Now cube root. So what do you mean by cube root? We find out the prime factor first. And then 2, 2 za. Okay then 2, 7 za. 3, 9 za. 3, 3 za. And 1 za. Okay so you write down all factors. 3. So you have 2 into 3 into 3 into 3. Now your power is 3 means all inside numbers plus you check out if they are all digits if they are 3 times you are the 9 they are all 3 times okay then this term is outside 
but you add on one digit one time here and then this is 3 cube root of 2 okay so your answer is 3 cube root of 2 so in this way in this process if a number makes inside is given and then you can convert into the very easy form so first you understand uh, before of operation addition before of operation subtractions before of multiplication